President Zelensky of Ukraine took great risk and flew to America. He spoke in front of a bipartisan joint meeting of Congress. He was heralded by both sides of the aisle. He was impassioned. He was thanking America for the support they've given him thus far and obviously looking for more support. He got a standing ovation, and it was well-deserved. But still, there are some MAGA fucks out there that want to talk shit. They're saying he's looking for welfare, if you will. Sean Hannity said he looked like a strip club owner. Donald Trump Jr. said that he was nothing more than a welfare queen, which is ironic, coming from a man who's never received a paycheck that wasn't signed by his daddy. This is the problem with MAGA. It's all about me. What do I get? When do I get it? And I need it now. They have no comprehension. They have no way of looking at a big picture. And they're paying the price now. They wanted to overturn an election. They wanted to overthrow the country. They thought, oh boy, we'll just do what we want to do now and we'll get what we want. But they fucked around and found out. And now we have the J6 committee's evidence coming to light. All these people that thought they were immortal are now finding out that they are, and they are going to start falling. Donald Trump amongst them. Whenever you have a group of people, do you say, hey, there's the dumbest one. We want them representing us. Well, no, of course you don't do that. But that's what we did for four years with Donald Trump as president. That's what the House of Representative Republicans want to do. They want the dumbest of them to control it. And this is where we've got to stop them. Because they do nothing but fuck up this country, cause us problems, cause chaos. With Donald Trump's taxes coming out and the January 6th evidence coming out, these people are going to be hard pressed to continue doing what they're doing. It's going to come from them, uh, come at them from all sides, and I'm looking forward to it. We need to control the narrative here and keep this stuff in the ether, keep it thrown in their face so they can't talk, so they can't fucking breathe. We had, are at a paradigm shift in this country. For six years, fascists have kind of controlled things. Well, now it's going the other way. We've got to keep up the momentum, shove it in their face, and finish them. 